What's up, y'all? So, just drove down to Round Rock to uh, check out these donuts from Round Rock Donuts. Um, I was gonna wait till I get home to show them to you, but um, your girl was hungry, so I think I'm gonna try one or not. <laughs> so, in this box that I have right now is a whole lot of lusciousness that y'all can see. It's a Bavarian cream, a uh, I think a lemon cream, a lemon filled, a strawberry, and then a chocolate eclair. Again, though it's kind of hard to see because of the box, but they in there. But um, I think we're gonna try this uh, strawberry one out. And I'll just hold up the other one so you can see them. This is the lemon filled, the Bavarian, looking like it's looking. And I think y'all saw the eclair. So nothing too crazy there. I love the color on them though. All right, but anyway, strawberry. Mm -hmm. There you go. Nah, that's pretty good. <laughs> My lord. It was like, um, Round Rock Donuts. Okay. Alright, I can kind of see what the hype is with it. This actually really good. It's so soft. Oh my god. Like, you don't know how Krispy Kreme Donuts is soft? That's like a different type of soft, but it's just really good. It's like, it's got like a little bit of chew to it but not too much which is completely disintegrating in your mouth like it's it's just right sweetness ain't too bad you know i can get down with it all right then all right then all right then you know but okay i just want to at least let you see one of them i'll get into the rest of them when i get home but uh yeah that's it for right now i'll catch back up with y'all in a little bit peace hey i'm back y'all sorry about that just back got back in the house so now i'm gonna give you the real review of what's left so, in the front here, we have the Texas cinnamon roll. Um, it's a little bit bigger than the regular size cinnamon roll, I believe they said, and it's got, it's sprinkled with these nuts. And then in the small box, we have a, what is this, a strawberry filled. And I think I said this was lemon earlier, but it is actually strawberry filled um, donut. We have a Bavarian cream um, donut as well. And then we also have uh, a chocolate eclair. So, we're going to do a little sample of each of those and i'll show you this one this is like the the grand poobah from up there so let's dig into this um strawberry one see what it's doing okay we got a look at that strawberry fill up um it's pretty good the outside is kind of flaky it's light filling is um the filling is pretty good as well um tastes like a regular like jelly filled donut <laughs> nothing too crazy but i mean it's pretty good i get it one mm, maybe like a six and a half and then on to the bavarian one mm -hmm, really get no cream out of that one all right let y'all see mm -hmm. the filling and stuff this one's pretty good too um i like the cream on this one Oh yeah, for sure. Cream is definitely really good. This is what sets up from the part. You get up in a solid 7 out of 10. Alright, now on to the good old chocolate eclair. Looking like it's looking. Doing what needs to be done. Not bad. Got a nice little chew to it as well. Oh my god, hands are like super messy. Alright, we're gonna move, move these out of the way. Get this little guy a try. Again, it's the Texas size donut with the peanuts on top. Just gonna pull a piece off the side. This is pretty good. It's kind of giving me, um, if you've ever eaten Lulu's, the, I guess it was like the restaurant or whatever that went down, that uh, went out of business. Not too long ago here in San Antonio. Kind of give me a feel of it, just like in a smaller version. It's really good though. Nice and soft. Alright, so what we went up there for, let <laughs> me get, in, get into this one. This is the um, Texas Half and Half. It's like their biggest donut. You can get it in full chocolate ice or you can get it in on glaze. I got a half and half just because I wanted to do something a little different. But um, so yeah, let me kind of give you the actual. This is the size of this donut. 
uh, the girl at the window was like, yeah, it takes almost as much dough to make one of these as it does like a 12, you know, pack of donuts. And I could definitely see it because this donut is huge. It has its own box. So, you know, it's got to be big. But let's get this one to try. I'll give it a little piece of um, each side to see what it do. I'm going to try just the glazed side first. Oh, that's really good. Oh, my God. This is their selling point is this donut for sure. This is so good. Nice sweetness. The dough is on point. Nice and fluffy. Got a little bite to it, but nothing like too crazy. It tastes like a good, it's a good donut. That's for sure. All right, all right, all right, all right. Get yeah, that definitely eight and a half. Let's try this on the chocolate ice side. I'm not a huge fan um, of chocolate ice donuts, but even with that being the case, this is still really good. Um, I'm definitely going to enjoy eating this. <laughs> Just doing the breast of it. Oh man. Definitely the dough, like I said, is really good. It's not super sweet, like it's sweet, but it's not like over the top. Like it's just right to me. Definitely get it, get it at eight, uh, eight out of ten as well. So, yeah, that's my review. Like I said, go check out Round Rock Donuts in Round Rock, Texas. Um, they got other stuff up there too. Uh, they got like coffees and stuff like that as well. So if you're into that, I mean, you know, you can grab you some of that too while you're up there. But this was all about the donuts for me this weekend. So, but anyway, check them out. Oh, I forgot to rate the um. The cinnamon roll. This probably like a. I'll, I'll probably get this a seven out of ten. It was too. It was pretty good. So, but um, yeah, definitely go up there and check them out. Again, I'm not getting paid for doing this. This is just something I wanted to do because I like donuts and I wanted to draw them out. <laughs> but anyway, if you're ever, ever up in the Round Rock area, give them a go. If not, you can make a special trip up there like I did. But definitely try them out if you're a big fan of donuts because they are pretty good. But all right, y'all enjoy the rest of y'all day and uh, that's a wrap. I'll talk to you later. Peace out.